Hi guys, welcome back to another Steam Free to Play walkthrough. Today we have Cyrano Story, which is supposed to be, I guess, like a sci fi horror game where it learns more about your fears and you're rewarded for it. I don't know how you get rewarded for them knowing your fears. Oh, there's an introduction. Welcome, newcomers, uh -oh. to the immersive and mind blowing puzzle world of Cyrano oh, I suck Story. Oh, puzzles. This permanent alternate reality game created by Allison Smith is a short and complex adaptation of the transmedia ARG experience that transmedia? took place in 2019 during the launch of Funcom's cosmic horror game, Moons of Madness. To thank devoted fans and help upcoming Moons of Madness players get in the mood for horrific otherworldly missions, our team has adapted the Cyrano story game and made it accessible for all, right here, for free. To get started, simply click on your first moon, analyze the given visual clues, find links between them, and give it your best guess. Uh. Write your answer anywhere in the darkness and wait for a response from the entity. You can oh. speak with this invisible force as many times as you'd like. You'll know you've broken a seal when one of Dr. Olivia Mason's transmissions has been unlocked. Keep in mind that most of these puzzles were originally designed to be solved by entire online communities. Oh God! In fact, we would be stunned if anyone would be able to complete this ARG without opening at least a few hundred browser tabs. Oh, God. So, no. feel free to reach out to the Cyrano Story community What's an ARG? on Discord for clues or take a look at the various ARG collectives by clicking on resources below. Whatever you make your experience out to be, shoot for the moon. Huh, that... This is a challenging game, and we hope you have fun playing it. That dude has a cool voice. I wish I had a cool voice like that. God dang. Um, but yeah, I'll put a link to the game in the description if you want to play it yourself. It seems like we're not going to beat this from what he just told me. <laughs> the hope is not real. Um, but it, also, if you like the video and you want to support the channel, please like and subscribe. Alright, let's give it a try. Oh, I'm scared now. Hundreds of browser tabs. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure. Don't give me the introduction. Again. Welcome, newcomers. Oh, to the he's doing it again. What? Why did I? World Skip. <laughs> I already clicked. I'm... What's the point of having the intro if I could just start a new game? I guess if you want to hear it again, but Lord, oh, click the moon. Difficulty saying easy. All right, what's the puzzle? Oh, that is a f how? Let's look at the Google. That is not Zeus, I don't think. How am I supposed to know who that is? That could be a random dang. Is it Athena? No, oh, Athena's got a helmet. What about Hera? Can we go up? Can I get a hair? That's not hair. Her hair is too nice. Hair's got nice hair. Screw it. You're getting closer. We are getting stronger. What do you mean? Then looking at him darkly, Zeus who gathers the clouds spoke to him. Oh, there's multiple hints. Do not sit beside me and whine, you double-faced liar. To me, you are the most hateful of all gods who hold Olympus, forever quarreling and it's dear to your heart. Wars and battle. I'm pretty sure this is Ares. Alright, what's the third choice? I just want to look at all the hints. Oh, I hit too much. I'm breaking it! I think it's Ares. Is that Mars? Okay, so it could be Mars or Ares. I'll give you some stronger. It's not Ares or Mars. We are getting stronger. What in the world? That's the God of War, ain't it? Why are you getting stronger? 
Is it Mercury? Not even close. Hermes. Huh. So I guess if you get... So it's not Aries. It's not Athena. Okay, let's Google this. Then looking at... It couldn't be. Someone else has Googled this. It's Aries. I typed in Aries. What? You're getting closer. Is it not Aries? I typed in Mars, I typed in Aries. You're getting closer. Lady. We are getting stronger. I'm gonna give you a stronger in a second. Is it, it couldn't be Persephone or Persephone. No. Alright, dang it. Why is it not working? Broken. Does that mean I got it right? Or does that mean I'm screwed? I don't understand. Oh my god. This is too complex. So it's Phobos. What the? What is your I don't know. Freaking hard questions. Freaking hard questions, dog. Am I alone? I was there again. There is a pressure, a vibration, a vilification, more like a growing hunger. An echo in a vacuum that resonates only in the in my mind. As I was watching it, I could feel feel a stare. It was spying on me, surveying me, scrutinizing me, taking not one of not of my every move and every thought. In my sleep, sleeping and waking states, always a voice imprinted in my memory. But the words are faded. The me blank. What is my? What is it? My voice. All that I recall is the fear, the instinctive alarm, constantly repeated. Get out! Get out! I was there again, as though the sleeping pills were just candy, absent of any me medicinal purpose. They told me that I would be fine, that I would not dream anymore. And yet, I was there again, surrounded by the abyssal mist that gazed into my soul like I was its next prey. Exhaustion is creeping in, but I am too anxious and scared to accept that I have to go to sleep. Also, guys, I am cheating. <laughs> Just to let you know, I've been cheating since I figured out the answer is not Aries. Doctor Olivia Mason, oh, we got an September fifth, twenty nineteen. Personal log number forty-seven. I've had trouble sleeping again. There's a voice that... Everyone is stressing the importance of regular rest, given my illness. I'm quarantined for the foreseeable future, maybe until the end of the trip. I can't abide idle time. I can't just uh, stare at the ceiling. So I've taken on a side project. <laughs> Call it cutting edge call it crazy but if i can advance it that might buy me back some goodwill with the company the rest of the crew doesn't know what i'm up to uh-oh i'm sure they don't care and 
NEV report submitted. <sighs> the company doesn't concern itself with the human touch. They have alarms for every type of report or inspection. At first, it's just annoying, but after nine months in, every alarm is like sandpaper on your nerve endings. I mean, I would think it was a psychological experiment by the company, if I didn't know better. Arigato Trevisan. I am sure we never could Trevisan. remember without- Fuck! You, things you don't think about when you daydream of space travel as a kid, lack of privacy, and just how much professional astronauts can get on each other's nerves when crammed into a vessel. It's the last leg of this long journey, and I mean, we're bound to get snippy with each other. We were even prepped for that in workshops, but... Like this. I, uh, I've Wanna been getting him. static from them for a while. None of them believe me. It's crazy. They whisper hypochondriac to each other. And it doesn't matter what they believe. The quarantine protocols are stringent and clear. If a crew member suspects they are sick, quarantine is enforced, regardless of the probability. Of they have to go through the motions, and that just makes them angrier. Hmm. I'm pretty sure they think I'm making it up. I thought it would be the company that came down on me for this, but they remain cordial. They poke and prod me with test after test. They keep pawing me with medical questionnaires that rival the 100-page NDA that got me up here. Mom, Dad, if you listen to some redacted version of this someday, I'm, I'm sorry I told you that I was in an undersea lab in the Mariana Trench. <laughs> test after test comes up negative. They say they can't find any physiological ailment, but... I mean, they will, they've got to. Something is wrong, I can feel it. But I'm more than this illness. Mm -hmm. This side project of mine, I'm near a breakthrough. If I can just... You got the god dang corona. <sighs> my body wants to sleep, but my mind is adamant about staying awake. I can still remember that dream. Darkness. Someone keeps repeating something. It's... Ah, damn. It's just on the tip of my tongue, you know? Mm -mm. Good night, Mars. Good night. See you soon. Dr. Olivia Mason, Navigation Specialist of the Cyrano, signing off. So she's either faking sick or not sick. She says people think she's faking sick, and she's... Quarantine yourself. This is a non disclosure agreement, apparently. The employee non disclosure agreement here in, is a pages, drafted pages, here and after known as the agreement is entered into between employee and the Rochi group, collectively known as the parties as of the day 20. The scope of agreement the agreement acknowledges that certain confidential information, trade secrets, and proprietary data here after defined and referred to as confidential information of the regard or of or regarding the company may have discussed between employee and the company here and after known collectively as the parties the province provisions set forth in this agreement define the circumstances in which the parties can and cannot disclose confidential information and include the remedy penalties and lawful action the company may take should such information be used or disclosed by the employee both parties agree that it is in their best interest to protect the company's confidential information and that the terms of this agreement create a bond of trust and confidentiality between them. In consideration of employee's commencement of employment or continued employment with the company, the parties agree as follows. Article 2, Confidential Information. A. Definitions. Confidential information is any material knowledge, information, and data verbal, electronic, written, or any other form, concerning the company or its inventions, discoveries, plans, concepts, designs, blueprints, devices, equipment, apparatus, products, prototypes, formula, formulae, algorithms, techniques, research projects, computer programs, software, firmware, hardware, marketing plans, 
Merch, oh wait, I skipped. Nanotech, biotech, proprietary DNA sequences, development and marketing plans, merch, merchandising systems, financial data, information concerning investors, consultants and employees, and any other concepts, ideas, or information involving or related to the business, which if misused or disclosed could adversely affect the company's business. <sighs> Exclusions. For the purpose of this agreement, information shall be de shall not be deemed confidential information and shall not have no obligation to keep confidential if the information was publicly known, the information was received from a third party not subject to the restrictions of. Okay, we did it. Hooray. But yeah, I'll put a link to the uh, a website that I cheated off so they can get some credit for having the answers. Because I don't know. Yeah, I already got destroyed by the Phobos thing. That was supposed to be sane. As not prepared you for this. Psych? Here, Ruet and Kat, Dio, Frederick, Bernhard, Ryman, Professor Zoo, Gott, and Gin, Gibberin, and. <laughs> I don't know, spoke in the German. Brasselines, Dan 17, September 1826, Gusturban in Salaska, Dan 20, Julie uh, 1866, Denon die Kot, Lieben, Moosen, Alla, Word, Zum, Besnen, Dienanen. Dienanen. What's the next one say? Your what is still It's a man. Okay. And be your soul. Just like my love. It's a crane! Crane game! How do I get out of here? I need to go click the other clue. Oh my god, it's Cthulhu. It's an Idris whore. I don't know what it is. It looks like an Idris whore. Alright, with the first. Da, 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 da. It is a Lovecraft Dune monster. I was correct. H D E two two six eight six eight. Yes. Yes. One of many configurations. Black Holio. The second the seal was yes. broken. The seals. Metal. Look at that thing. It's the clips. Well, uh, clicking the symbol revealed an image over the, at the center of the photon sphere. Stop whispering at me. Talk. Talk like a regular person. Dr. Saying. Olivia Mason, September 9th, 2019. Personal log number 54. <laughs> okay, so ah. sleep is still a little elusive. Uh, that said, I'll always take this frenzy of a new theory than simple, unimaginative dreams. Although, not that my dreams have really been simple much lately. <laughs> 
I know, I know, I'm on a ship hurtling through Mars on a mission my clandestine corporation is keeping a secret from the rest of Earth. That should be the dream, right? <laughs> right? But this other project, oh my god, I haven't told any of the others. I, I can't, they'd laugh at me. I couldn't blame them, it's so far out there. Okay, so um, I dug through the company's archives, everything that they have for the work of Dr. Newhart. Archives. She's something of a mathematics superstar. I mean, she's a bit infamous on account of her theories turning really strange at the end uh, and having some kind of nervous breakdown and vanishing from her family years ago. Full disclosure, I was a bit of a fan. I read all of her books including The Impossible Angles and Spaces Between the Wall of Sleep. The company tried to hire her for years and she always turned them down. And I know how frighteningly persuasive the company can be, but she still turned them down. More power to her. But these archives, my God, they have work she never published. I mean, most of it's incomplete, but how did they even get this? It's this grand patchwork of theories from Planck, uh, Heisenberg, Riemannian, Sir Arthur Stanley Eddington, as well as the notes of less reputable sorts. It hints at cracking the code of the geometry and curvature of space, like unlocking the higher dimensions of non-Euclidean reality, <laughs> bending space, folding space, finding shortcuts in between. <laughs> I know. Like I said, Watch it's me. way out there. But just a few hours ago, I made a link. Me. I solved a bit of the equation. The rest of them were stuck on. It's like inspiration struck. It's, it's unlocked something in my head. And my mind is moving faster than my hands can take notes. I think all of this might actually work. I mean, we're still light years from all that, but... I'm closing the gap. <laughs> I might never sleep again. <laughs> God, I, I can't tell anyone. But God, once I get this down solidly, the company is going to salivate for it. This could change everything. <sighs> it won't matter if they think I'm crazy, if they also think I'm a genius. <laughs> uh, Dr. Olivia Meisen, navigation specialist of the Cyrano, signing off. All right, lady. We get it. You're a genius. The Angelus Mark IV, deep space communication technology brought by Manticore, relays information from Invictus Base to the Rochi Deep Space Network on Earth. The DSN consists of six point array communications facilities, two sets of three antenna array arrays placed 120 degrees apart throughout the Earth faster than the conventional X-band radio wave systems. Yes. Ooh, difficulty crazy. Not if you're cheating, like I am. You know me, I try to beat games without cheating, but if I am gonna cheat, I'll let you know. But this one, I cannot. Once I figured out Aries wasn't the answer to the first one, I was like, this is gonna be way too hard. I'm too dumb. 40 degrees. That's some kind of coordinates. Excuse me. But when the mind is moved by shock more fierce, we mark the whole world suffering all at once. A long man's remembers sweat and paler polar spread. All right. Busk, Spencer, Hooker, Spottiswood, Franklin Huxley, Tyndall, Hurst, Lobick, Lobach. All right. And then, yeah, and if you want to know like where the what the clues are hinting at and how the researchers that were on this website figured it out or whoever figured it out, um, I'll link the link will be in the description as well, so you guys can see what like the reasoning was for these answers. Another yes, it's like a metal song when these two start talking, the dark voice and the woman that whispers at me. I feel like I'm listening to some mumble rap and rap metal. A uh, drawing of a flower. Look at that dude. He looks old and tired. Is that Vincent Van Gogh you painting, son? Where's your. Oh, Northa! 
phone and one that was there, uh, Lamar Kiana. Researchers discovered that these clues pointed towards non-Darwinism theory. Entering mutation. Three-day transfer inoculum, 3x10 to the power of 5. All right, and then... Yes, I want to evolve. I want to be an Ivysaur. Yes. Let us grow into you. That's hot. It's Olivia. It's October the 15th. Personal log We're number. Achievements. Let's go. Whatever. No sleep. They threw me a birthday party. It was awkward, forced smiles all around. I made pleasantries through the door, but mostly I just listened as they spoke to each other in a language I couldn't understand. There were moments though that I felt that I was beginning to recognize some of it, maybe. I don't really believe that, but I can't stop half hearing these words as something familiar. Ugh, I need to rest. My head feels fuzzy. I keep bumping into things and knocking all my papers over. But I want to focus on my work. Let me tell you a story. Or a story fascinating tidbit to get myself drowsy. So recently, back on Earth, some scientists experimented on chicken embryos. They blocked the proteins of two genes active in the formation of the chicken's face. You know what happened? <laughs> Instead of chicken a beak, explode. the chicken embryos grew mouths with teeth That's terrifying. like a dinosaur. It's, scary. it's a different way to look at what we inherit from everything that came before. I mean, it never goes away. It's only hidden there. It's like covered over. It's the secret language of our DNA. We're just books inside of a haunted library of wriggling things. <laughs> we are filled to bursting with gills and claws and fins and tentacles, all of it ready to surge out of us, only held back by the thinnest scrim of a couple of proteins. It makes me wonder what is being held back by seemingly greater things than ourselves. If a carbon-based life form can be hiding all of this within the DNA, an individual's immortal cell could expand indefinitely with sufficient provocation. I believe this map holds a key. What else can I bless you with? What other captivating note can Brains I down in Africa. Well, I'm further down the rabbit hole now, past Newhart's unpublished notes, into supposed fragments of the Nakotic manuscripts, the Book of Eben, even the incomprehensible equations that were scratched into the cell walls of a witch who vanished from the Salem trials. I'm so close. This sequence in our blood is a melody. It's radiating from a light that I'm trying to free. It's a source of power and a portal into the past. It's just like our DNA. I can't quite hear it yet, but I know that this part of us is because of it. I'm I'm going to crack this. Then the company will have to recognize me. They can't stop this. They won't hide my work within their files away from the world. Psych. They can't stop me. This is... Um, this is me, Olivia, on the Cyrano signing off. I feel like she has a real overinflated sense of self-importance from these transmissions. after time, it's nothingness. You'll be one step closer to knowledge if you ascend.
outside of its realms. The merge is inevitable. This is not a dream. You done? You done? Same stuff I can't understand? When the mountains take leave of their senses, when the skies breathe their final breath, when the moons rise never to wane again, the dream ends and there will be no remembrance for what never was its nature horror. Excuse me. Hooray. We did it. Mystery solved. What is this? Seems like they took out, there was like a live event for Cyrano, Operation Cyrano, and that apparently isn't on here. So that's fine. The sky keeps on turning. Don't know where I'll be tomorrow. Oh, we on the sky keeps turning. Okay. Let's type in Zodiac. You need an inhaler. <laughs> yes. Compulsion made a great consort. Yes. The world made that spawn things. Iliad, Book 5, Line 385, 13 months and 7 years ago. Oh, look at that freaking, what's those called? Chimera? It's a chimera? It's gonna breathe the fire. They destroyed him. Alright. Bush Clue Titans. Yeah, this is cool because, uh... Yes. All it took was two giants. The wiki tells you a lot of things about what happened when the researchers were trying to figure out the game itself. Like, there were things that they put in and they struggled with. It seems like this actually fixed a lot of them. Like, it took out the live event that's mentioned on the wiki. Um, it seems like the game was being updated and that there was a lot of things that weren't put in correctly that weren't allowing the characters to like get further into the game. But that's kind of cool. Yeah, if you like this, I'll definitely check out the wiki. Burning the entrails would kill them all. Oh, 
shall I proceed? did it. Hooray. Dr. Olivia Mason, personal log. Time feels meaningless. I've changed the flight coordinates and we move closer to the moons each day, yet the only sign of time moving forward is my own deterioration. I expected kickback from the crew, from the company, but everyone's a go. Despite my illness, they still trust me and will thank me later. My headphones, however, they were less than thrilled. They have been hissing at me. A voice is there. It's hidden within the static and it's buzzing. A warped voice is present. It's trying to warn me of something and it's, it's different from the voices that come to me when I'm forced to rest from exhaustion. No, this is different. The buzzing voice is trying to make me stop. It's causing d- debilitating migraines. They are so severe that my nose starts to bleed. But I've put my headphones away now, so it can't get to me. You know, it's probably nothing. Uh, I'm probably just stressing myself out with how close I am to it. The voice is probably just my headphones somehow picking up the crew, uh, speaking to each other, and I'm just looking for something that I can recognize within it. A sort of audio pareidolia. (laughs) I'm so close. The work opens an event horizon in my head. It devours ignorance. Space is relative. Everything is connected in a perfect void. We're way past the Telling Us Theorem. The other dimensions are not so very other. We are not alien to them. The human brain contains vestigial structures, sensory organs, that could detect these higher dimensions. They're not distant places. They might be an arm's length away, just in a direction that we have no word for and cannot truly Comprehend. We might have vestigial organs, north, south, east, whole west. vestigial extremities <laughs> in parallel places that we cannot even sense. We might be vast organisms. And a lot of what ifs. What were we? If one were to understand the secret geometries, one could reach out a hand and directly touch another person across the room, across an entire football field. I could reach inside and pull out an organ, dripping, palpitating, without leaving so much as an incision. You have to reach in a direction that's like diagonal, but not. The voice that whispers to me while I rest, it's very crafty. I it's figured it out. To mimic the I know voice what she's of talking my conscience. About. It's interjecting into my own internal monologue. I fear how it may manifest in my thoughts. How much are they truly my own? I think the company knew about all of this. I think they'd let me find those files to set all of these events in motion. I think the Cyrano has a purpose beyond the crew's known mandate. I think they wanted me to be the only lab rat who can see the maze from above. Dr. Olivia Mason, navigation specialist of the Ship of Fools, signing off. She's talking about the hand from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. You remember when he can, like, erase space in between him and another object? He can erase the the distance between... That's what she's talking about. I'm sure of it. All right, Kukus. Kukulakis. Mission Control wants you to crunch some numbers on a potential future visit to the two moons. Think over the logistics and of both an Earth-launched and Mars-launched mission. Work some rough calculations for both scenarios. Make this a priority. Also, have a look at the moon orbits. Phobos should be 1.4 Martian diameters. 
out with a 7.66 hour orbit in Deimos at 3.15 diameters and 30.35 hours, but Mission Control says they showed up as significantly closer faster. Might be a glitch. I'll leave you to it. Josie! Okay. We did it! With the power of cheating, anything's possible. <laughs> Which one have I not done? This one? Mental breakdown! At least I can mental breakdown. It is a dangerous thing, but ignorance is no protection. I fail. That's not the English. I can't read to that. Oh crap, I clicked the wrong X. I was supposed to let it fade out. I forgot. I'm not a big sci-fi guy, so not like you. a dangerous thing. Oh god. But ignorance is no protection. Just want to see what this does. I don't think this is the actual answer, but it's something that's on the wiki. Nope. Levi H. Dowling. why you don't smoke kids your voice box gets destroyed and you freaking and then the other is Edgar Case Glasses. Someone gave the moon glasses. That's what the hint is. God, why do I keep clicking that? I'm so dumb. Stop it. Oh no, you have to restart if you. Oh no. Jesus. of life the circle the circle of life Oh, man. I'm an Amadeus. Much of your pain is 
self-chosen. Yes, my favorite. I have seen the dark universe yawning, where the black planets roll without aim, where they roll in their horror unheeded, without knowledge or luster or name. Hey, shh, it's all right. Remember, seven and nine, down the onyx steps. That's it. We're getting closer to the moons. We have right. to be close when the moment comes. But not this close! You sick fucks. My private thoughts. Is my work entertainment to you? All you filthy little voyeurs. Do you feel clever? Because you managed to catch my signal and listen to my sufferings? Leeches! And to what end? Do you... Do you think that You're there's toxic. some kind of connection between us to the moon and star, to the spaces of my mind, or the... Something is wrong. I can't hear the voices anymore. I just hear the noises of the ship going on like a ghost. Am I dead? <laughs> No, no, I can't believe it. I've been doing work that will change reality for our species. You've, you've been drawn in by something that is happening to me that I don't understand. Why is this happening? I don't think I did this. And I still can't hear them. I am so alone, except for you absentees. I can't hear them, but I think I'll hear it when I sleep. I wake into that horrible sound clawing into my core while I fall into the black red muck! <laughs> oh. <laughs> shut up! 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 You shut up. I solved forbidden equations. Equations oh. that broke the minds of renowned men. I made sense of Gilman's indecipherable sure scribbling. God. I reached past the last oh. curved rim of space. Past blasphemous <laughs> infinity. I unraveled the terrible cosmic narrative. I poured over myth cycles that predate humanity. Read all the impossible names and the hideous contexts. I shake off the shekels of natural law. I'm the opener of the way. I part the veil. I draw back the curtain on nameless eons and inconceivable dimensions of elder, outer entity. I see them in the spaces between, reaching out to me with hands that are not hands. I have seen the face of God. And it is terrible. Oh. The rest of you, you're all complicit in this, but you can make Sorry. it right, since I have an audience. I want you to recite something, all of you. Record it. Spread it, and your voices will reach me through means not wholly known. This is important. Are you ready? Gonna Repeat this phrase bomb. after me. Seven and nine, down the onyx steps. Seven and nine, down the onyx steps. There will come a time when I see you, but you won't see me. This is me. I am nothing. Nothing exists, save empty space. And you. And you are but a dream. Signing off. Oh, God, that lady's annoying. I do not like her. Mineralod mineralogical analysis of Martian soil and rocks. Des Declaim Delapore. Employed Manticore's X3 spectrome spectrometer to analyze Martian rock and soil samples to identify the relative abundance of iron-bearing minerals, including carbonates, phyllosilicates, uh, clays, hydro hydrooxides, oxy hydroxyoxides, fur to ferrous ratio, determination of the properties of magnetic phases, including the size distribution of magnetic particles, nanophase versus larger particles in the Martian soil. This data provides information regarding the nature of the atmosphere, surface chemicals, and physical weathering processes involving 
bearing phases, we shall find this relevant in studying the evolution of volatiles and climate over time on Mars. Because surface materials are major volatile sinks, in point of fact, the problems associated with understanding the evolution of volatiles on Mars is understanding the processes in the past and or present that are responsible for oxidizing the red planet. The X3 spectrometer is a prototype of Manticore, see NDA entry. Performed admirably, we'll write more in-depth notes on improvements that might be made for p future production. As Commander Wilcox broadens our exploration, we will analyze a wider array of samples. See, she's an example of maybe too much knowledge. Doesn't really help you. Like, she has done nothing except whine at us. And, uh, I don't know. I feel like it's not really helping. Difficulty, higher plan. Just going crazy. She's crazy lady. Do you think this is a dream? Oh yeah, I gotta type in. No. If you type yes, it kicks you out. In the bottom of the sea. There's a home. There's a home. There's a home in the bottle of the sea. Oh, that's not it. They don't like that. <laughs> How long can you survive without air? question this isn't one of the ones uh, I guess hearing oh I got some clues it's a jackass on a wheel what the heck it's like a festival or something what is that dude doing So Moons of Madness game. The answer is release the dreamers. The old ones were. The old ones are. And the old ones shall be. This is likely the last personal log of Olivia Mason. The date? I'm here, within the planet's gravitational field. <sighs> After an infinitely long journey. <sighs> and I'll never even walk on the surface. Young Flegeth. Gokaro wa kedishtoi. That's not the English. I've spent my life in the pursuit of science and wonder. The unexplored and... The unexpected. But with each new discovery came nothing that wasn't already present. The suspiciously long shadows were always there. I just didn't know where to look for them. I can see them everywhere now. They've replaced my crew. I used to find it annoying that they only spoke in a language I can't speak to one another. Now I long for the comfort of recognizing that it's Japanese. Recognizing that I'm audibly hearing it at all. Go Minnesai. To my family and friends, I love you to the moon and back. <laughs> I'm sorry I'm not in the Mariana Trench. Do something with my savings. Make sure everyone brings a plate. And enjoy yourselves while you still can. 
To those who have kept me company, you have reached me, and for that, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have ever reached back. It knows you now. It knows your Psych. fears, your guilt, your weaknesses. I don't have any. I've doomed you all. Please do not feel responsible for what is to come. Your words did nothing but ease my own guilt. And finally, to Dr. Newhart, wherever you are, <laughs> I couldn't have done this without you, and uh, I only wish you hadn't left your work for me to finish. Ya um ya, ya from see ya. You are experiencing what has happened, what is happening, what will happen. From the wells of the night to the gulfs of space, and from the gulfs of space to the wells of night. Praises to the mollusk titans. Praise and abundance to the black goat of the woods. Yeah, the black goat of the woods. Yeah, the goat with a thousand young. Yeah, phone of Sagen. Yeah, knife Sagen. Yeah, ask soon. Yeah, Dagu. Yachshag. Yeah, Shog. Oh, that's what she told us to say about it and say it. Ha ha ha. You didn't get me. Big brain. Alright. There's also another ending that we're gonna put. That's scary. Is that what happened to Olivia? Jeez, Olivia. You got de-aided. Crazy lady. You've defeated Serena's story by cheating! Oh. And you get a copy to the... Moon of Madness. Alright, cool. Yay! Let's write this down. In case we do decide to play the game and cheat at that one too. Because these are too hard for me. I'm not a puzzle man. But this is a cool game if you like to figure out stuff by having like a general knowledge of things and wanting to do research. I'm not that person. I play games to play games. I like in-game puzzles sometimes. I'm usually bad at them, but I like them. But this kind of thing, I can't figure out for myself because I'm dumb. But I want to get the other ending as well. I might have to skip to it if it makes me start all over, but... Let's see. Continue story. See what happens. Ah! Crap! I don't want to replay through it to get the other ending, though. Oh, no! Alright, that didn't take as long as I thought, but we'll get the second ending now, guys. Think this Yay. is a dream. You get an achievement for that, type in yes. Well, I did it. I mad. Oh, did it close the game? You son of a bitch. <laughs> ah, I did get an achievement, though. Ah, that was toxic. Think this is a dream. I don't close my game. She roams through space. She has a Where? How long can you survive without air? What sense are you willing to lose first? The dreamers. The old ones Shit! Were. No, no, no. The old ones are. Ugh. The old ones shall. I did it again! Oh, fuck! Alright, this time it's for real. God dang it. Do you think this is a dream?
Alright, Bill. What will you do? This is a different ending. We did it. God. His fear of the unknown. This is likely the last personal log of Olivia Mason. The date? Uh, Did it just whisper I'm yes? Here That's within toxic. the planet's gravitational field. After an infinitely long journey. I'll never even walk on the surface. <laughs> Yon Fleggeth. Gokaro wa kedishtui. There she goes again. I've spent my life in the pursuit of science and wonder. The unexplored and the unexpected. But with each new discovery came nothing that wasn't already present. The suspiciously long shadows were always there. I just didn't know where to look for them. Say I can see them again. everywhere now. They've replaced my crew. I used to find it annoying that they only spoke in a language I can't speak to one another. Seems like the same transmission. Now I long for the comfort of it's recognizing toxic. that it's Japanese. <laughs> recognizing yeah, that I'm audibly like hearing it at all. I really think so. Go minisai. Go minisai. <sighs> To my family and friends, I love you to I hope the, the memo is different at least. <laughs> I'm sorry I'm not in the Mariana Trench. She starts going crazy Do again. Do something like with this. my savings. Make sure this everyone brings the a plate and enjoy yourselves while you still can. To those who have kept me company, you have reached me, and for that, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have ever reached back. It knows you now. It knows your fears, your guilt, your weaknesses. I've doomed you all. Please do not feel responsible for what is to come. I don't. Your words did nothing but ease my own guilt. Feel nothing. And finally, to Dr. Newhart, wherever you different. are, I couldn't have done this without you, and I only wish you hadn't left your work for me to finish. You are experiencing what has happened, what is happening, right, some what will of it happen. Different, but most of it was the same. From the wells of the night and to the gulfs of hard, space, and from the, the gulfs of space to the wells of night. Is this different? Praises to the mollusk titans, prayers and so. abundance to the black goat of the woods. No, it's not. Yeah, the black goat of the woods. Yeah. The goat with a thousand young. Oh okay, yeah, guys, I'll yeah. leave a link to the I'll game in the thug. description, and then I'll also yeah. leave a Can link to the again. wiki that I used to figure yeah. out all the answers. Um, hopefully, you enjoyed yeah. the video, and Not if you good. did, please like and subscribe. Yeah. I always Shug. appreciate that. Yeah. I'll let her Shug. go through her crazy spell again, and then we'll end the video. So, bye. There she does. Seven to nine. Oh, Onyx Sumpter steps. Something, something menacing. I'll download that Moon of Madness game if the Steam key works, but I don't know if I'll play it. If I, if there's a wiki, if it's not like this, if you could solve the puzzles in game, I'll do it myself because I like to beat the games myself. But if it's something like this, I'll have to use a wiki because I'm too dumb. I don't have enough knowledge of the world. I'm not, I'm not a pursuer of knowledge like that while I'm playing a video game. But yeah, bye.